Hey guys, um, it's me, Ruben. Today I'm gonna show you how to get this holiday glam look. We got some like gold kind of champagne pop on these eyes. We got this glitter going on and then we got some like cranberry, more like warm colors. I mean, yes, man. So if you wanna see how I did this look, then please keep on watching. Okay, so to get started, you'll need to have your base on. Um, um, so I already have that on. So I'm gonna start it on the eyes. And to start, I'm gonna take my Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Light. I'm just gonna take a little bit on my eyes, which is really creamy. And this will keep the eyeshadow on longer and it will make the eyeshadow pop more. And to set that, I'm gonna be taking the Huda Beauty um, Textured Shadows Palette. I'm going to be taking the shade Bay, which I actually like this name. Um, it's one of the names I like. And then I'm going to take the Sephora Tapered Crease Brush. And I'm going to just take a bit more of that and set in that, just so that's really nice and matte and it doesn't go everywhere. I'm just going to kind of buff that into the crease really like lightly. And I'm going to kind of like, and then once you put it in the crease, kind of blend around it. So you like blend and like buff all the edges out. So what I'm doing, I'm kind of working across into a more like a red tone because I don't want to go straight into that because it'll look really harsh. So I'm going to get this one and just blend that into the, more into the crease and just buff all the edges out because I really want this to be look really nice and um, really nice and blended. I'm going to take the shade Man Eater. I, I like, I prefer the names in this palette to be with you. Like, it's kind of like a really nice cranberry colour and it's really nice for um, winter. So I came with this colour combination because they kind of like complement each other. So this is more warm and then it gets more kind of red and um, I think um, holiday makeup is always, I think it looks better when it's like more red and gold. Stila. So glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow and just kind of get it on the product like that. Like, okay, can we take a minute to look at this? Look how nice that is. Use these and mix them a little bit. I think they'll be really nice. Um, they kind of look a really dark cranberry. The Kat Von D Shade and Light Eye Palette. It's going to take the really, like, the really black shade. Bring it up. Yeah. Rose gold. Just a little bit of that because these are really pigmented. And put that like, in between. The Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in the shade Trooper. Crease is here and you want to see where the crease finishes and you want to kind of follow where the bottom lash line is. So you follow the bottom lash line, bring it up to the crease and then go a little bit further, so yeah. And make this tiniest little hole, like, like kind of like a circle. And then you want to kind of bring it like that. the Stila Stale Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner in Cobalt, which is like a really nice electric blue. And this is gonna complement the red so well. And what you wanna do, you kinda of wanna blend it into the black a little bit. So you wanna... I'm gonna get the um, same eyeliner, but this is in the shade Snow. You wanna see where your natural eye shape is. So if your eye comes to here and you have that, well, everyone has that kind of inner corner. So you want to kind of follow where that would end. So like down here. I want to get the whiter shade from the um, Kat Von D palette and just go over that. Okay, so I'm going to get the black and the, like from that Kat Von D palette and I'm going to really just bring it just on the lash line. These are the, um, Lana lashes, yeah, the 10, <laughs> I love that. I wanna bring it around. And then just make sure you cover the lash because we want this to last all night or all day. Again, whatever kind of situation you're in. So you wanna keep it as like as far on the lash line as you can. You wanna like blend the black eyelash, the fake eyelashes into your real eyelashes. So you wanna get the tip of the mascara Um, and I think the eyeliner kind of complements it because it like out 
My, my eyes look like dolls. Oh my God, can we get some appreciation up in here? Okay, so I'm gonna do my lips now. Red lips don't suit me as much, so I'm gonna do a kind of like um, a nude. And I'm using um, the Sephora crayon lip liner. And it's nice and sharp. If you like to overdo your lips, like, but you don't want to look like false, so see this kind of like white rim around your lip. You want to go on that. Basically, as long as you cover that white rim, you're okay. So, you can just stick to lip liner if you want, but um, personally, I would use the lipstick on top. Mm. Okay, so as you can see with everything balanced out, the skin is kind of left out, so I'm gonna put a little bit more highlight on. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use the KKW powder contour and highlight kit, and this is the medium one. So I'll give like the, oh. I feel better now. So this is the finished look. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. Um, this is this is a look you can wear to like grocery shopping if you wanted to, or you can wear to a party. I reckon this could work anywhere, and this will turn your heads. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.